Well, I have one story I want to tell. I can do it before or after your final remarks. You go, please. Uh, just because we talked about him. I think I probably told you this, David. Mm-hmm. Martin Short did tell the best joke I've ever witnessed in my entire life. Which was, we were we were rehearsing the show, and they were having a, a camera problem, so we had some downtime. Yeah. And he walked over to our set, because all the sets on sitcoms are like built next to each other, right? Yeah. And just started entertaining uh, myself and uh, John Mulaney and Nassim Padrat. He's so uh, like filled with Hollywood stories. Mm-hmm. We try to prompt him, be like, what about Richard Pryor? Do you know Richard Pryor? And he go, well, Richard's interesting. And like he'd either do that or he'd do bits, right? He's like always doing bits, always trying to keep everyone entertained. So he sat down on the couch next to us on the set. Mm-hmm. And he was like, oh, I'm just going to take a nap. And then he started doing impressions. And he was like, here's my impression of Mama Cass. And then he like pretended to eat a sandwich and then started choking and then spit it out and then started eating the sandwich again. <laughs> like he just started doing all these like tasteless, you know, like old Hollywood legend jokes. Uh-huh. And um, then someone, somehow Karen Carpenter got invoked, talking laterally off of Mama Cass. And he got serious. And he went, do you know uh, that the uh, house that Karen Carpenter died in, uh, it's still on the market. They tried to sell it. It was this beautiful mansion in the hills. They tried to sell it afterwards and no one wanted to buy it and it was you know it's originally like three million dollars and it's gone down over the years but it's they've still never sold it. it's still on the market it's down to like three hundred thousand dollars now it's just there and Mulaney went wow so it's just no one wanted to sell it just because it was like creepy and he went no kitchen <laughs> it's pretty funny <laughs> it's really good and Mulaney sat there awestruck and he went Wait a second, that joke is reliant on someone asking the question. He went, but they always do. <laughs> and he went, how long have you been telling the joke? And he goes, I don't know, when did Karen Carpenter die? <laughs> this all sounds like a great conversation. And then he was like, you know, I've, he went, did you have to adjust the price of the house? He goes, I adjust for inflation a little bit, but it's important <laughs> that the price of the house at the end is low enough that people ask because they're thinking maybe I could buy it. Right, right. <laughs> so that's the best joke I've ever heard in my life. 